Heart failure with normal ejection fraction, that is ejection fraction more than 50% is challenging to diagnose. Most of these patients get treated with a lung specialist because they are misinterpreted as having lung infection. So that disease can be diagnosed by echocardiography, but that requires advanced modalities to on the echocardiography to make the diagnosis which are not available at every place. Uh, short of that, we can look at who are the people who are more prone to have preserved ejection fraction, they being age more than 60 years, female gender, people who are having long-standing hypertension, atrial fibrillation, people who have got long-standing diabetes, obesity, chronic kidney disease. These are the group of people who can be prone for preserved ejection fraction heart failure. The gold standard test for making a diagnosis of heart failure with preserved ejection fraction is cardiac catheterization which can differentiate whether the heart failure is there or is it a lung problem.